Tech for Humanity, part of our youth leadership program Youth Connect, took place in five European countries and aimed at offering knowledge and skills to young people to envision a world where technology serves as a catalyst for positive change. During the program, we asked young people across Europe to work in teams and create a video with recommendations about what leaders should do to shape the way we develop and use technology. Young people were free to use digital tools such as AI avatars to convey their messages. Over 30 videos were produced on subjects ranging from sustainability to conflict. Youth Connect is our global leadership program in the British Council that aspires to offer the skills, inspiration and connections for young people to tackle uh, major challenges such as the digital transition. Tech for Humanity is a strand of the Youth Connect program in Europe focused on digital skills that includes a mix of on-site learning activities in the participating countries, but also brings together young people from Europe and the UK to exchange views on uh, how technology can improve our lives uh, and uh, shape the future of humanity. Disinformation was an area of particular concern for young people and they addressed topics ranging from critical thinking to using a food hygiene approach to address its spread on social media. This recommendation from Cyprus was to make science great again to counter false claims about climate and health. Science is not just about laboratories and research papers. It's about improving lives and solving real-world problems. Make science great again. Another key concern is sustainability. Young people were clear about the need for systemic change to tackle the sustainability crisis across a range of areas including solving the microplastics problem. This recommendation from Ireland was to leverage technology to reduce e-waste. AI will drive a circular economy, turning waste into resources, empowering the repair movement and reshaping our future. Some participants in the workshops were keen to explore ways of making government services work for everyone, especially those from underprivileged communities. This recommendation from Cyprus was to use technology to make government services more accessible and therefore more inclusive. Technology can be a force for good. Let's make government accessible for everyone. With the world changing quickly, a key concern was providing relevant education experiences and access to quality education in low-income countries. Recommendations from the UK included leveraging AI to bridge educational gaps and enhance learning outcomes. The technology may be widespread, but the knowledge on how to use it safely is not. And it is the UK government's responsibility to ensure that this becomes the case in our country. We are seeing a range of negative impacts from climate-driven displacement, so young people recommended leveraging technology for ecological resilience, including re-greening vulnerable areas to reduce the need for people to emigrate. A recommendation from Greece was to leverage technology to address climate-driven displacement and migration. Re-greening vulnerable areas strengthens local economies, heavily reduces the strain on migration systems and mitigates the human financial and political costs of this climate refugee crisis. Another concern was the ways in which threats to democracy and peace are evolving. Young people explored topics from making democracy better for everyone to countering bioterrorism, and this recommendation from France was to redefine warfare to the best extent possible. What if we deepen development of ethical technological solutions in a military context to mitigate devastation?